They've been here in Midtown for about 30 years, and it is the end of an era that it is closing this morning. Michael Scott, the manager of Chubby's, uh, talking to us this morning. Michael, what's, what's the feeling of everybody in here right now? You know, as we get closer to the 6 o'clock time, as we just passed, it gets a little more emotional as we know the time is about ending. Um, we've had the last couple tables come in, and each of them have come in almost teary-eyed. It's the last moment, so it's been a little emotional trying not to get that way, but uh, very tough. And the staff's doing a lot of energy right now, so we really appreciate that everybody's hard work and just trying to keep it together for the last few minutes. So. What does Chubby's mean to, to, to you, the employees, the neighborhood here? I, I mean, it's been, it's been a staple. Huge staple. You know, I came here and didn't even know about Chubby's uh, to begin with, moved up from Wichita, and, uh, you know, the main stories that people have told me and how it used to be across the street and then the avenue and then down here, and it's, it's just a staple for so many people. And, you know, the years that I've been here, everybody's talked about their family being here and how such a tradition to keep bringing back or when they come in from out of town. So been very, very blessed to meet so many new people and so many great people, and so it's been awesome. A lot of people have been in Chubby's in the overnight hours to, to get their last meal, and, and they're still going to be a similar Chubby's, the same company that owns Chubby's, also operates the uh, Neighborhood Cafe in Waldo and Lee Summit. Got similar menus. They'll continue to serve their famous cinnamon rolls there as well. So Chubby's is going away here, but Neighborhood Cafe is remaining open. A lot of the employees from, from here will, will transfer to some of those places, those restaurants as well, as they continue their tradition of serving up some of the best food, some of the best diner food in Kansas City.